Hi, uh, this is Richard. I'm a huge fan of Tim Ferriss' uh, 4 Hour Work Week, and today I'm going to show you a little uh, trick or a little technique that I've saw in his blog, 4hourworkweek.com/blog. And there is a guest post from uh, Pavel Satsuin about the 80/20 workout routine, where you can improve your strength uh, in a short amount of time. Uh, I, for the last uh, four months, I think. Yeah, for once I was practicing this uh, workout. It's based on a f uh, five repetitions on five sets of training and concentrating only on the uh, three power lifts: deadlift, squat, and bench press. And during my uh, during this four months, I made incredible progress. I'm currently I'm uh, currently bench benching uh, 85 kilograms. That's about 190 pounds, and my, my body weight is uh, 80 kilograms, which is about 180 pounds. I'm deadlifting 145 pounds today, uh, which is about uh, what? No, it's about it's 145 kilograms, which is about 300 pounds. And I'm squatting 100, 125 kilograms, which about yeah, uh, 175, 275 pounds. Actually, 145 kilograms is around 320 yeah, pounds. Yeah, that was uh, my uh, deadlift weight. Okay. Okay, but anyways, so uh, <coughs> What, what the, the workout is based on uh, the principle that you do uh, five repetitions and five sets, nothing more. No warm-up sets, no nothing. I've uh, already uh, done some bodybuilding uh, before using different workout style with lots of warm-up sets and stretching and lots of variety of exercises, uh, which took me about two hours. Um, it didn't really work for me. Uh, it uh, was confusing and I got bored of it. But this workout, I train three hours per week, nothing more. That's it. Uh, on three days, Monday, Wednesdays, Fridays. That's everything I do. And during the uh, two months, uh, November and December last year, I was working a nine to five job, and even then, I, I did. I sat in front of the computer for the whole week. Did only three. So hours of workout and that's it and I improved my gains massively it's all this uh, poundage that I mentioned before that that's what I did in, in four months um, yeah and I have some couple of, of uh, things that I want to mention uh, how I kind of worked out the little details in the workout plan so first of all um, you need some kind of uh, you need between the sets and between the sets do you make uh, a at least five minutes uh, break to recovery and it has to be five minutes and for that I uh, use a stopwatch that's in my mobile phone so I, I use this and I always know uh, that it's exactly five minutes and I also have uh, during these breaks I read and I've printed myself uh, the blog post. Uh, here is uh, Pavel 8020 powerlifting and how to add 110 pounds to your lifts. Um, during the five minutes breaks of my set, I read all this blog post. I read it again and again and again. I think I've read it a hundred times during my workout breaks. This keeps me focused and motivated. And uh, it also helps me to work out the little details because there are a couple of small things that you also have to get really used to it until it becomes a habit. And reading it again and again and again uh, really helped me achieve that and do it better. Also I make some notes about uh, how much I train and uh, also I, before I start a set I always uh, write down the number one, two, three, four, five. I write down the number, then I do my set, then I take it off. And then I make my break stop for five uh, minutes, read the powerlifting guide again, and I go back to the metal and
do the thing again. I know. It, I make notes about uh, every set because uh, when I'm working out, I want to be completely and totally focused on the workout, and not. I don't want to be uh, kind of distracted. Uh, I don't want to be distracted by anything else and if I have to think about how many sets I'm going to make then I'm distracted and I cannot do my workout. So this is why I write it down. Also it helps of course that uh, if I'm doing the 5 reps I know that I have to add 5 more kilograms or 10 more pounds next week so that I can gain and this is also in my notes. I added a note that I have to add some stuff. Okay, now. Um, I've also, uh, actually the, the guy who is filming uh, this video, is he's my brother, he's called Robert and he's a, he's a powerlifting uh, champion, he is uh, doing powerlifting national and international, he's competing and yeah, let's see what he has to say to the... Yeah. Hi, I'm Robert and I lift weights since I'm 13, I'm 25 now and I compete in powerlifting nationally and internationally, as my brother Richard said. I've been uh, two times uh, Austrian champion in the 100 kilo class, and I've never used, and I'm not using any drugs of any kind. Okay, <clears throat> um, I've seen lots of powerlifting programs and powerlifters and the way they train and everything. And um, what strikes me about this program is that A, it really does work and B, it takes very little effort. So basically just keep it simple and uh, stick to the basics and then you can make fast <coughs> progress. And uh, <laughs> that's actually, uh, that's just uh, an illusion, you know, that was not for any kind of big success or anything. I actually, that was the 10th place, so I really sucked in that competition. But, like I said, I am pretty strong, you better believe it. But, okay, let's get back to okay, the program. Hey, for now, now, just for, for uh, th uh, things, uh, I'm going to kind of show you the three uh, exercises and what you need for exercises, just to, uh, to round it up a little bit. Okay, now, um, here's our work, uh, the front space. Now we have a bench, we have a stop rack, and we have lots of weights. So, <clears throat> yeah, okay, I only do the... Uh, Three basic power lifts, nothing extra, and yeah, I'll show you. Yeah, that's the bench press. I lift 85 kilograms here. Uh, Richard, I, I think you should mention it when you say you lift 85 kilograms, that's the weight you lift five times. I lift it five times. So you would probably exactly. bench more on a max. Yeah, but I'm not uh, yet, I think I'm not ready for competition yet. Even though know, in this four months I have made tremendous progress, but yeah, maybe three or four months more than I can compete. Then, yeah, then we have to. That is needed, no fancy uh, exercise, machines, whatever, it's unnecessary. Okay, with the uh, squat, you have to be careful to do it right, I think, um, so that uh, Robert is a uh, specialist on what is necessary for competition. So you have to really get, you have to get down until your thigh is in a kind of this position, and then up again. And of course, the deadlift. Okay. Here I try to really pull it out of the back, use the legs, don't like go like this, but really kind of pull it out. Size. Yeah, that's it. Thanks, Tim, for a cool book and keep it up.